Hi and welcome to Real Reviews, my name's Martin Carr and today I'm going to be talking about The Killing Kind which is out on Paramount Plus right now and stars Emma Appleton and Colin Morgan uh, in what many have described as a sort of a cutting edge courtroom drama slash stalker thriller. So let's get into it shall we? Right, so The Killing Kind is actually based on a novel by Jane Casey and it comes within a series um, of novels which all uh, essentially approach the same sort of subject matter. She is a crime novelist. This particular story is adapted by Jonathan Street and Zara Hayes and comes to Paramount Plus with Emma Appleton playing Ingrid Lewis, who is a defence attorney, a defence lawyer, and she is... Um, has defended John Webster, Colin Morgan's character in the past, um, uh, for stalking, for sexually, um, shall we say, indiscreet behaviour on a professional level. Um, and the story itself revolves around their relationships and how um, how he still manipulates her and uh, to what extent their relationship went from the per went from the professional to the personal uh, and hinges at least in that first opening episode it hinges on um, her relationship with Belinda Gray who uh, is played by Sarah Powell who is then uh, mysteriously involved in a hit and run uh, in a London street busy London street um, carrying Ingrid's umbrella uh, and that is the premise and the story rolls on from there. So the question is, is it any good? Right, so here's the thing. Um, as good as The Killing Kind is, at least in the initial two episodes, and as good as Colin Morgan and Emma Appleton and Nicholas Rowe are, Nicholas Rowe is familiar to people who have seen young Sherlock Holmes and may have seen the occasional Guy Ritchie movie. Uh, he plays Angus Gray, um, which is... Belinda's husband, who is Belinda's husband. So, um, as good as these char character actors are, as good as their performances are, unfortunately the, the program, the show, the premise itself is really um, generic and, and, and reasonably predictable. There are, um, there are some really cool camera, camera moves which happen and there are some really interesting uses of flashback and, and ways that, um, should we say, plot points are introduced and, and and, and again, it really tries to up the ante in terms of technique and presentation of the overall plot. But um, unfortunately, what you're going to get as an audience is you, you've seen this before and you might not have seen it done this particular way, but there is no doubt that this has been done to death. So my feeling with, with The Killing Kind is as good as it is, it could have been better, which sort of lands it somewhere in the mediocre um, sort of a realm of things. Um, so on that note, I'm going to move on to my rating. So, um, as I've said, um, Colin Morgan and Emma Appleton as Ingrid and John Webster are really, really good. Um, as Ingrid Lewis and John Webster, I should say, are, are very, very good. But unfortunately, the material that surrounds them um, is not as good. The story is, as I said, it's quite generic. It's quite, um, quite pedestrian. Uh, as much as they do try and jazz it up with various camera angles and, and, and various interesting uses of flashback. Um, so for that reason, more than anything, I'm going to give The Killing Kind a three out of five on the uh, big old five scale. That's a three out of five on the big old five scale and and we're gonna just move right along because it's trailer time right so as you can tell you've reached the end of my video for the killing kind this is the bit where I go to you do you like the video if you've liked the video then like the video and give me a thumbs up if you want to drop a comment in the comment boxes below then you can do that too and um, failing that if you want to subscribe every Tuesday and every Saturday when I drop another one of these bad boys you are going to get a little ping so then you can just dive right in and watch as much or as little as you wish so until next time take care and remember Watch those videos.